Hey guys, so um, I got gifted, say hi Zach. Zach, say hi. Okay, anyways, I got gifted with um, some funds to go to Ikea, specifically to Ikea. And so I did get a couple of things. Um, wow, I didn't realize how messy my house was before I started making this video, but I wanted <laughs> to make this video. Um, so I could show you guys that I am replacing, um, my medicine cabinet. It is the medicine cabinet that came with this. Is, this is like plastic. This is super, super cheap plastic. Um, and as you can tell, it is held together with duct tape. And I mean, like everything is just really, really cheap plastic, super, super cheap. Um, and it's, it's almost ghetto. I had been looking for a medicine cabinet for uh, a little bit. I went to ReStores and I went to other places like that in order to find one that was pretty discounted. My goal was like $20. Um, I found one at Ikea for $40 and it's definitely more my style and um, I'm definitely uh, excited about it and I hope that it fits but I am going to show you guys how I'm going to take down the medicine cabinet and hopefully install a new one and I hope that it fits and um, my measurements were not off and such because if it was I, I might cry um, because it's such a beautiful medicine cabinet and I had such a good deal for it and I mean not only that did I get a good deal but it was like a gift so to, to go there and be able to do that so um, I shall start with the installation or actually taking that old piece down so so not much to empty in it I just put everything in the sink and there are in mine there are only four screws um, so I got my drill and I am just gonna take them out with that hopefully I won't have to use an actual screwdriver okay so this is the medicine cabinet. Clearly I have not cleaned on top, so please forgive my filth. Um, and oh, I mean, it's just, I mean, it's just super cheap plastic. Whoops. Um, and here is the bare wall. So actually the bare wall itself looks better than that ugly medicine cabinet. So I'll unbox the other one and hopefully it'll be an easy install. This right here, um, is where the actual beams are, I, or studs, I should say, are. And um, I'm hopefully just gonna be able to screw them pretty close to where those are. Okay, so here is the new one unboxed, and it lifts up and opens like that. Um, my concern. My concern with this one, I guess, is, is that it's significantly heavier because it's steel, I think. So I'm really just hoping that this fits. And it's a little bit more narrow than my old one. Um, however, this is like a little retro-y, and it's definitely way more my style. Um, and, it, and the price was excellent. So you can't tell, really, but... I've marked the holes right there and right there and right there. Um, so it is a lot more narrow. Now the hard part about this is that um, holding that up by myself was not easy. So that's the a downfall to being a single RVer and trying to do things like this that might require two people. Um, so that's a little bit of a downfall because it was kind of heavy and my kids are... Uh, not old enough really to just help me with stuff like this so that was uh, a bit of a, a task but I did it okay so done with the install like I said it's a bit tricky doing this by yourself so if you're a single RV or doing this and your new medicine cabinet is a bit heavier um, then it is a bit tricky now this is not meant for an RV is the thing so I'm going to have to find a way to keep this closed right here. This does like pop open like right here and then slides over, which is kind of cool. Um, so I can put the shelves in there and everything, but um, it's very secure and um, way cuter. And I'm hoping to paint like that 
white I don't know what I'm gonna paint it but I have white paint and since I already have it and it's free I might do that but um I love the new medicine cabinet and I'm so excited for the old one to be in the dumpster I do need to fill in those nail holes um, but I'll get that done and then I'll just paint the bathroom uh, eventually it'll be really cute when I'm done whenever I get done but wanted to show you guys that and um, it's not it was not that hard at all so an easy update and I'm really thankful for the person who um, gave me the gift for Ikea. Bye!